warning from a Little Rock man tonight after a kayaking trip turned into a near drowning. Thanks for joining us tonight at 5, everybody. I'm Hunter Hoagland. As Susan L. Corey explains, he hopes that close call will be a good lesson for others. Yeah, his bottom line is that rivers are unpredictable. And just because where you launch, it's calm, doesn't mean it's going to stay that way downstream. I feel like I had help from above to get out. Rue McClure is taking some extra precautions before paddling out on the Arkansas River. He spent hundreds of hours on the water filming documentaries. That's what he was doing on a recent trip to the North Fork River in northern Arkansas when his kayak hit dangerous water. A shoal that created a, a small waterfall and as I traveled into the waterfall, basically my kayak went over the waterfall, filled full of water and sucked me down, um, pinning me and my kayak at the bottom of the river against a boulder. He believes his life jacket helped protect him as he tried to push free. From now on, McClure says he'll be wearing a helmet every time he goes on the water and hopes others will follow suit. He tells me he counts himself lucky that he walked away from this with just some cuts and bruises. He also credits a man who was out fishing for helping pull him to shore. In Little Rock, Susan O'Corey, back to you.